It's 7 a.m. on a summer morning inside Washington Grizzly Stadium. It's quiet. No fans here to cheer on the team as they go through the grueling rigors of summer conditioning. But knowing what's around the corner keeps the guys motivated. I haven't been out here when we're playing games and you know, knowing the excitement that this atmosphere has. Uh, coming out here in the summer when no one's out here just kind of, you know, gets us yeah, you know, kind of psyched up and really ready for the season. Man, we just want to be the best and the, we work out to be the best. And if coach wants us out here at 6 a.m. or 7 a.m. to run, to be conditioned, because that's what we that's what we're going to need to be a good team this year, we're going to do it. The man leading sprints this morning is the new strength and conditioning coach, Matt Nicholson. Nicholson spent the last two seasons with Coach Bob Stitt at the School of Mines, and he couldn't be any happier to now be in Missoula. Just very humbled. I mean, just very humbled to, to have the opportunity. Um, but, you know, at the same time, really taking taking pride in, in, in the job that I do and, and understanding that it's it's a great opportunity, but but I'm here here for a reason. As a strength and conditioning coach, you have a unique relationship with the players, as sometimes when it's 6 a.m., you have to be the one to push them to give it their all. You have to have a good relationship with them. They, there has to be um, good communication with you w between uh, myself and the players, but at the same time, when I'm telling them, hey, we gotta, we got to ramp it up a little bit, too, you got to... You know, like you said, you gotta you gotta wear you gotta wear a couple different hats. So it's just kind of finding that good balance. But at the end of the day, um, you know, always loving the guys up and, and letting them know when they're doing a good job. And if they're not getting it done, let them know that too. I, I like Coach Nicholson a lot, but he's just just like another coach. But he he gets on you if you're not doing it right. But he'll love you up too. Uh, coach Nicholson's great, man. Uh, he gets us working, he keeps us going, keeps us on track. Uh, doesn't really let us mess around too much, which is good. Nicholson played linebacker at the University of Houston between 2006 and 2010, but missed 20 games in his final three seasons because of injuries, something he now uses as a focus when coaching. The greatest ability is availability, and that's we think that that's that's very true as far as uh, you could be. You know, you could have the best bench squad or whatever in the world, but if you're not available on the field, if you can't help us on the field, it doesn't do us a whole lot of good. So we always uh, keep that in the back of the mind. But at the end of the day, we want to we want to get guys stronger, we want to develop them, we want to get them faster, um, but we also want to make them we want to make them durable. In Missoula, camp starts August 3rd, and I can't wait. That does it for sports. We'll be right back.